Hey everybody, Uncle Claude here. Got a nice letter here from LLM. Uh, let me read it to you. Um, I would love to see a video titled A Day in the Life of a Typical Day uh, from the moment you wake up and the time, until the time you go to bed. No wonder you're looking so trim, all that running and fasting, don't you get hungry? Um, basically, um, I think doing something you love is important. My general lifestyle uh, is uh, I don't eat during the day. I have one meal a day usually. Um, I have a normal dinner. Um, during the day, I drink a lot of water, black coffee. I don't put cream and sugar and stuff in there. I drink a lot of water. I drink herbal tea, unsweetened herbal tea. So I do a lot of liquids during the day. I usually get up, uh, particularly in the summer right now, I'll get up 5, 5.30 in the morning. Um, I run 10 to 15 miles a day in the summer average. Um, I like running. You can see I got all the um, different race. I do a lot of different races and things like that. I really enjoy going out in the woods and trail running uh, for the, not so much the road running, but going out in the trails. I live here in Colorado, which is real easy to do trails. I've gone on trails I've never seen before. I run every day. Um, I usually just um, the equipment I take is my Apple Watch and uh, a pair of AirPods. Uh, I listen to uh, different uh, podcasts, audiobooks, um, uh, music. I love music. And uh, the mileage just disappears. I will do uh, in the morning five, six, seven miles. Then I might take a second run in the afternoon, um, do another three, four, five, seven miles also. So it really depends. I average, I would say every day at least um, 10 to 12 miles average, but many days I do. 15 miles, especially on weekends. On weekends, I can do 15, 16, 17 miles. On my birthday just recently, I did 33 and a half miles. I like running. Um, I usually then go after a run, I go to my health club. Now, I, I live in California also, and I run in the California canyons, and there's a YMCA near my home. Here in Colorado, we have a, what we call a recreation center. I go in there, I do swim laps every day, after my run, I usually get in about 10 good laps uh, swimming. Uh, then I take, um, um, I usually do go in the jacuzzi, steam room, sauna. It really feels very good for, on my skin, uh, frankly. So every day running, every day swimming. Um, I would say four or five days a week, I work with weights. I like to work with dumbbells. Every day I do sit ups, uh, about, I'd say 50 to 100 sit ups every day. Um, eating, uh, I eat one meal a day. It's called OMAD. Um, uh, I eat a normal meal at night. Uh, we don't have meat every night. Uh, I eat a lot of fish. I always have big salads and things like that. Um, I do like a glass of wine or beer. If you ever watch my beer with Claude, uh, I do like that. Um, so, uh, that's kind of my average day. Um, I can get in an occasional power nap in the afternoon, 30 to 60 minutes when I need it. I don't do it every day. Get very busy here. Um, I talk to a lot of people all over the world here from uh, my home office. Um, but I like to be outside. I like to be active. During the winter, I ski. I still try to run when I'm in California or Hawaii or North Carolina. These are other places I live too. Um, it's part of just a daily routine. You get into that uh, commitment. You know, the thing about um, living longer is just taking care of yourself, eating well. Um, and um, it's very easy to maintain your weight when you're eating once a day. Um, I, uh, Dr. Jason Fung is a great book, um, The Obesity Code, if you want to learn more about it. Uh, Dr. Walter Longo, L-O-N-G-O. Uh, these are people, there's some really great breakthroughs about diet and uh, controlling hormones and things like and insulin and things like that. I'm not a doctor. Um, I think everybody has to find the routine uh, what works for them. For me, eating one meal a day, uh, a lot of liquids, um, exercise on a daily basis, which I enjoy, as I said, um, helps me to maintain my weight, um, stay healthy, stay competitive. It, it gets harder as you get older, you know, you, you keep up your energy level. Um, so I like to be high energy. I like to, I like to feel good. Um, I work at it real hard. Uh, every day. It's a commitment like anything else. And, um, and that's kind of my daily routine. I go to bed pretty early sometimes. 
Uh, my wife and I like to, uh, you know, have a nice leisurely dinner at, at night. Uh, we will open up a, when we celebrate a good real estate deal or sales training or something like that. A good month in business. We'll open up a real good bottle of wine. Uh, we love our fila of vineyards, by the way. Oh, by the way, my coffee is um, its my only sponsor because it's a good friend of mine. And I know this family and I know his kids. Rocky Mountain Roastery in Fraser, Colorado. They make the best coffee I've ever had in my life. Um, they actually buy the beans wholesale. They roast them themselves. And uh, you can find them real easily. Not a commercial here, but just friends I love to help out. And but I love their coffee anyway. I pay for it. They don't give it to me. I don't want. It. I wouldn't accept it unless I pay for it. Um, lifestyle, staying healthy. Uh, ex, you know what do doctors always say? Diet and exercise. Um, basically, I don't get hungry during the day as long as I have a lot of liquids. It's it's a case of conditioning. Um, I'm at my high school weight right now, uh, and I like staying there. I've had, if you watch my older videos, my weight goes up and down. And I finally, a couple of years ago, found a way to control my weight um, by eating in this pattern. Um, I tend to eat very healthy. Um, if you've ever watched uh, Forks Over Knives, I, we, I like to eat a lot of fresh fruits and vegetables. Our refrigerator is full of apples and oranges and pears and bananas love bananas i have a i eat a banana every day the potassium is great for you um i have a big salad every night uh I, a lot of times i make up my own uh, vinaigrette dressing so i love salad dressings but my god they're high in calories um so i try to watch what i eat when i eat and mix it up if i'm running 10 miles a day that's an easy thousand uh calories extra i have um, and, um, if we eat a, a, a lighter dinner, some nights, uh, you know, we have, a, we eat a lot of fish, uh, off the grill and stuff like that. Um, I'm not anti-meat, but I eat, when I do eat meat, it's very small portions. It's usually, um, very clean meat, um, that I get from a good butcher, um, things like that. Um, and so, um, that's kind of my lifestyle. I get up early, I go to bed early. Um, every day is a gift. I enjoy every day. Uh, I like feeling good. I like feeling healthy. Um, I like staying at a biological age of 36. Uh, uh, that's the way, um, you know, you want to feel as good as uh, you pick an age that you felt your best and that's the age you want to work towards feeling regardless of how old you are or what, what you get to. I don't want to be on a lot of pills. Um, I watch my cholesterol. I have, um, my little blood pressure checker here. Uh, my blood pressure is very good uh, because I'm a runner. Um, it stays very low. Uh, I watch my cholesterol also. And it's, it's a question of taking responsibility. American diet, without sounding boring here, you know, a lot of those processed foods and things like that, they're not that good for you. There's always room for an exception. I, 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 I've always talked about in and out Burger and things like that and French fries and a good corned beef sandwich or a good steak once in a while, not every day. Not, uh, when I grew up as a kid with my parents, we'd have meat three times a day, you know, bacon and sausage for breakfast, uh, a bologna sandwich for lunch or a BLT again, and then meat, pot roast, hamburger, steak for dinner. And I don't eat that way anymore. Uh, when I have meat, it's maybe once, once every two weeks, every three, four weeks. Uh, and I have a small portion of it. I, I do enjoy the taste of a good burger or a good steak once in a while. I just don't eat it that often. Um, I eat a, I love salmon, things like that. And I eat a lot of, uh, a lot of trout, um, sardines and things like that. You guys know I love pizza with anchovies on them. Uh, but this is part of, and that's something I do every day. So one meal a day, look it up on YouTube, by the way. There's a lot of good information on OMAD, one meal a day. Um, it's, it takes a while to, to learn how to not have breakfast and, and lunch and things like that. Uh, it works very well for me. Maybe it'll work for you. I'm not a doctor, uh, so check with your doctor. That's my disclaimer and everything. But if you can work at this stuff and feel as good as you did, you, you want to fit into those high school genes, don't you? Um, there's ways to do it. Um, if you want more information about this, call me. Uh, be glad to share um, my life's adventure with you and uh, how I, I try to stay healthy. Um, I do answer my own phone, 
let me say that again, 970-281-5151. If you enjoy this video, hit the subscribe button and the little bell, do a thumbs up, share this with your friends. And remember, nobody deserves good health more than you. Life is short. Live every day healthy and work towards it. You can do it too. If I can do it, believe me, I'm nobody special. You can do it too. Thank you.